Welcome to Planetary Annihilation Titans Mechanics. In this video I will cover the Neville units. The Neville units are extremely durable, powerful and have high attack range. The units can only move in water except one unit. And the most Neville units has very slow movement speed. Piranha is a gunboat. It has water hover which means it can also move over shallows but not on land. It's a cheap and fast boat which deals a bit damage. It is most useful in early game and can only attack land and water surface targets. Naval is a frigate. It attacks land, air and sea targets. So it is the all-rounder in the seas and uses three different weapons for all kind of targets. Targets on water surface will be attacked by two weapons. One weapon targets units on land and water surface and one weapon targets units on water surface, underwater and sea floor. Barracuda is a submarine. It's specialized to attack sea and undersea targets with high damage. Many units cannot target undersea targets. And the naval can only shoot with one weapon on submarines. Orca is a deep water destroyer. Bit more attack range than naval and very durable. The damage dealing however is a bit weaker than naval's damage. So it's good to outrange some units. The kaiju is a hover destroyer. It's like Orca in attack range but with higher damage dealing, more durable and the ability to hover over land, lava and water. The Kraken is an advanced submarine. For underwater targets it is not stronger than Barracuda but very high damage with his second weapon to land and water surface targets. The Kraken is invisible for radar. It is like radar jamming of the vanguard but without hiding nearby units. Kraken is a good unit to destroy torpedo launcher but it cannot outrange the launcher. The Stingray is a tactical missile ship. It has high attack range and high radar and sonar radius. Stingray can also attack orbital units. It has three weapons. One weapon targets land, water surface, orbital and air. One weapon targets air which rapid fires with high damage and the last weapon attacks incoming pods shot by an unit cannon. By the way, the other tactical missile units, except Hornet, also got one weapon for incoming unit cannon pods. The differences between the tactical units is attack speed and range. But all tactical missile units have pretty high cooldown. To shoot many incoming pots in a certain area, the umbrella is the best way and relatively cheap. The Leviathan is a battleship, huge attack range and high damage dealing. It is like on water moving Hulkens. The range is not that high like the Hulkens, but the total DPS is greater. It fires with 4 weapons with 3 projectiles per weapon and per fire. The last naval unit is Typhoon. Typhoon is a drone carrier. Its attack range is high and sends air drones to attack. It consumes metal for the production of the drones. And the drones automatically lose health. With Angel you could keep more drones alive and protect them against homing missiles. Thank you for watching and sail safe in planetary annihilation. Bye bye.